Okay, everybody, this is Swan with Black Box Stocks. Uh, this video, we're going to show you how to integrate TradeStation with Black Box. You can uh, buy commons or uh, options right from the Black Box Stocks website. So, that little preview video kind of showed you how it goes. Uh, this is going to be more, a little more in depth for you. All right, so this is the welcome screen, the main screen when you first log in. To get over to the Trade station integration. First thing you need to do is go to your settings, go to account, go to my settings, and then uh, what's going to happen is a box is going to pop up, and you need to enable Trade Station trading. So make sure that box is checked. Uh, once you do that, click this arrow here, go to trading, and this is the account information. It starts with a simulated login. All right, you need to click on that button. When you click on that button, it's going to take you to Trade Station's sign-in page. So username, password, and then you have to go through the client uh, security question. And once you do that, I'll show you what it looks like here in just one second. Okay, I went ahead and done that. Now you can see you have simulated login and live login. Uh, for this, I'm not going to do live login because I would show my personal account information. But uh, for this demonstration, we'll just stay on simulated login. Okay, now I can do commons. So if I want to click on, uh, let's say here, go to a firm. Click on place trade. Oh, I clicked on MA, sorry. So I'm on Ma uh, MasterCard. Hit place trade. It pulls up the... A symbol it pulls up the buy I can also then go to sell or sell short buy to cover uh, the quantity how many I want limit market stop limit stop market uh, limit price so if I want to do a limit price it's currently 344.85 let's just do a market order of one share uh, it's an equity this is the simulated account if I had other accounts shown here I would click on that and then you can click on your other accounts if you have multiples um, there's the bid and the ask currently. I hit place order. Gives you one last chance to review. Hit OK. And just like that, I was filled at 345.10 right there at the ask. Okay, and then if I go over to positions, there it's sitting in my account. Okay, that's on the, uh, now if I want to do a share of a firm, same thing, AFRM, hit place trade. It goes to buy. This time I'm going to say I'm going to buy hundred of them at market limit price or limits shut off because I'm at market um, day trade hit place order hit OK and I filled at 133.14 which was the ask so there we can see them loaded in there all right now to do options I click over to the options side and let's see let's pull up uh, uh, Apple uh, here you can look at the different contracts that you might be interested in getting in and this is why it's so convenient because as flow is coming in you can be in your you can have those contracts in your account just that fast so let's find something here how about these uh, this week's 140s so I'm gonna click on that see it narrows it down to all of this week's 140s for options I'm going to go up here to this area place trade and there's the contract Apple year month expiration week it's a call it's a 140 I can buy to open sell the close sell the open buy the close um, it defaults to whatever your quantity was set last so this is contracts so because I bought a hundred of the affirm it stayed at a hundred so you got to watch that okay so we'll just go to 10 contracts uh, you can mark it in or you can limit in and then same thing day trade and this is an option trade all right um, if you wanted to change this, let me just go through this first. Place order, hit OK. And I've got 10 contracts in at 275 a contract. Okay? And then if I wanted to go back and do these again, but I wanted to change the contract, here you can type in what you want to change. So let's say I want to go to the uh, 142s. And to get that price, I hit get quote. And there it shows me that quote. Let's say I want to get the 142 puts. Just change the C to a P. Get quote. It shows me the put. 
let's say I want to get next week instead of this week. So I type in the 15th instead of the 8th for a 142 put. Get quote. It shows me the price. So you can change it here uh, very easily. Um, if you know what you're looking for, if you want to alter the flow or alter the contract, you can do it just by changing the symbol. Once you learn it's the symbol, the year, the month, the, the week, put or call, then the strike. And then you can change it to whatever you want it to do. So we'll, we change it to that, place order, hit OK. And just like that, I've got 10 of those at 225, 225 as well. Now to close these out, it's just as easy. You click on the one you want to close. So I click it on the Apple 140s, hit new order, and there it is. It says I own 10 of them, and I want to sell to close. And I'm going to mark it out of those, place order, hit OK, and I'm out at 273. It takes it off my page. Next thing, the Apple, next week's puts, 142s, same thing. I'm going to sell to close, but let's say I want to uh, only sell five of those. So I'm going to change that to 5, and I want to limit out. Currently, they're going for 226 by 227. I'm going to set that to go for 228. Hit place order. Sell to close. Five contracts, 228. Hit OK. And then it's going to acknowledge it here. Okay, The order's been acknowledged. So now I just need to wait for it to be filled. And when it fills, I'll know because it'll show me another banner, and I'll get that same tone that you're hearing in the background once it fills. Um, on the Affirm, I can close those out too, but I need to switch over to Equity. Let me get this done here. Oh, you know what, I forgot. On, I forgot on the stocks, you gotta go back to the stock side. Sorry, my mistake. So I go back here, look at my pro, there's my uh, account. Click on AFRM, I have 100 of them, new to order sell the close or sell i've got a hundred of them down here i want to close out a hundred of them and currently 112.93 by 113 so let's say i want to limit out at 113 hit place order okay it's going to acknowledge oh i filled it so it got me out at 113. So I just went ahead and filled it. Okay? That is how you use TradeStation integration with black box stocks. The absolute fastest way to get positions into your account. All right? Everybody have a great day. Stay green. And this is Swan. Thanks for watching.